Hey guys, so yeah, okay. I haven't talked to you guys, talked to you guys, more like made a video in a long time. Um, yeah, so today I'm going to be doing my everyday makeup look that I've been doing lately. Um, yeah, I haven't made a video in a long time. I'm so sorry, you guys. Um, thank you for staying subscribed. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Um, sorry, I'm umming a lot. Um, yeah, I haven't been making videos in a long time. I've kind of been m focusing more on my other channel, um, Vardance One for One. I make dance tutorials, so if you'd like to, you can check that out down below. I've been kind of focusing more on that channel. So, I don't know, I, I really love, you know, I love making beauty videos and stuff, but I guess it's not my top priority right now, so I'm just going to make them every once in a while, you know, for fun, whip out the camera, put on some makeup, maybe do a haul every now and then. It's been, like, crazy storming, okay? Oh my gosh, like, pa 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 pouring rain. I woke up this morning, my dog jumping on my bed, freaking out. She freaks out, okay? Like thunder lightning when it's going boom boom she is running oh my gosh okay I had my door shut I'm sleeping me and my sister sleeping like seven in the morning yes you're probably like what the heck I get up at five in the morning well we have a different school situation da 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 we can sleep in anyway so we're like sleeping and scratch she scratches on instead of knocking she need we need to teach her how to knock she scratches not good. So she's like scratching. And so my mom opens the door. She like jumps on her bed. Oh my gosh. She gets so scared. And it was so weird because like the door, like whatever doors were shut, like okay. So we're sleeping and this door shut. She's scratching on the door. So we open the door, right? I go into the bathroom. She scratches, like just to go to the bathroom, you know, in the morning. She scratches on the, do the bathroom door and there's like other people out here she can run to. Um, so, I don't know, it was like whatever door was shut, she would scratch because she didn't know where to go to, like, be safe from the thunder. But right now it's pretty nice. It, it's, like, still overcast, but the sun is peeping through just a teensy bit. It's not raining right now, but it was, like, pouring and, like, it was just, like, oh, I got some film. We'll put it in right here. It is, like, downpouring and a lightning just flashed and that was scary. like pouring I want to see if I can like catch a lightning bolt it was just pouring and then thunder lightning it was pretty cool but scary at the same time I don't know when like it goes lightning and then thunder right away that means it's super close and it was pretty close and it, I was getting pretty scared but you know that's just how I roll but yeah so crazy craziness this morning um yeah so and I'm sorry this isn't a Halloween tutorial or anything um I usually do my tutorials when I'm getting ready for the day so like I wear that makeup throughout the day and stuff and so like if I did a Halloween tutorial it'd just be kind of crazy I just I don't know I didn't feel like washing it off or whatever I don't know I want to do some but I don't I don't know I'll have to like think of what I want to do because for Halloween I think I'm going to be a flower child or like a hippie or something like that you know um so yeah I, I I think I might I might do that tutorial we'll see I'm gonna like part my hair down the middle it's gonna be cool yeah but I don't know parting your hair down the middle is just weird so I don't know we'll see if I can pull it off I'm probably gonna like get something to like wear around my forehead just to make it look cool, you know. And I have like piece dangly earrings. Sorry, this is like this is like fluffing right now. See? Woo! I don't know why. Well, actually, I do know why. I tried this experiment earlier. Um, after I got out of the shower, I got bobby pins and I took some of my hair and wrapped it around my finger like as if I was curling it. Then I just like pinned the bobby pin, and you can't really tell it's like falling out because I took it out before my hair was all dry. So it worked at first, and it was like, ooh, it was pretty. So I think next time I'll try it, and I'll like wait till my hair dries all the way. But anyway, enough of this blabbering. Let's go ahead and get into my everyday makeup tutorial. Okay, so first I'm gonna prime my eyes with this Beauty Rush cream shadow, and it's from Victoria's Secret. Um, I ran out of my Urban Decay eyeshadow primer potion, so this works just fine. 
Um, it has a little, it's a little bit pink. Here, let's see if I can get this to focus. It's pink with like shimmer. Um, it doesn't really show because I put the eyeshadow over it so the eyeshadow covers up the pink. So I'm not really going for a pink eyeshadow today. It's more of a gold, but this works just fine as a primer. So I'm just going to go ahead and put that on my lids and just rub it all over. And this just really helps the eyeshadow to stick and stay vibrant all day. Okay, so first, for the eyeshadow, I'm going to be using my Coastal Scents 88 Shimmer Palette. And I'm going to be using a really light gold color that's really pretty and really superly, superly pigmented. And it's this one right here. It's on the left of the palette. See how much that gets on there just like by dabbing it a little bit. So I have to get the excess off. I don't like wasting it, so I kind of try to tap it back into it below a little bit because it gets a lot on there. And I'm just going to pack it all over my lid. And it just gets, it's really vibrant. It's a vibrant gold. But it's really pretty. Now I'm going to do my other lid. Okay, next for the highlight, I'm going to be using this light, um, it's like a nude color. It's pretty much the same color of my skin, but a little bit lighter, and it's just going to brighten up my eyes. So I'm going to take that on my brush, and I'm just going to put it um, right on my, right on, under my eyebrow. Just like that. You can barely tell, just... It's very light and natural. I just realized my closet was open, so got that taken care of. Okay, so for my eyeliner, lately I've been wearing it with like a winged up look, kind of like I don't know, Taylor Swift, I guess, but I don't know. I think it's fun and it's really pretty. So that is what I'm going to go ahead and do. Okay, so it's not easy to get them perfect. As you can see, mine are not perfect. Um, I'm going to go ahead and apply mascara, and I'll be right back. So you can probably tell I got brighter. I opened my shutters a little bit more. But now I'm done with the eyes. As you can see, you can see the wings going on. Now I'm going to apply some blush. And the blush I've been using, and you guys have probably seen it in my other tutorials, is this Jane blush. And um, yeah, it doesn't really have a name. It, it says on the back, it says Blushing Earth Sheer, but it's kind of a lame name if you ask me. I'm just going to go ahead and get some blush on my blush brush and apply it to my cheeks. 
my cheekbones. Oh man, that side is a lot. Now, I just like to fluff it out and make sure it's not too much. Ooh. Okay, so now for the lips. Usually I apply Carmax before I do my lip gloss just to I don't know, I don't like moisturizing my lips with my lip gloss. I, I just feel like the lip gloss is like sticky and not really, <clears throat> sorry. <coughs> okay, like kind of like sticky and not moisturizing like Carmax is, but I don't know. I don't, I don't know. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and apply this to my lips. Just in the middle of the bottom lip kind of work it out and a little bit on the top lip I've been usually I've been using this Milani um, lip gloss and it's called chic and pink and it ha it's pink and it has gold shimmers in it it's really pretty that's the lip gloss I've been using lately but the, also the lip gloss that I've been using is in my purse. Let me go get it. Hold on a second. It's this one. And this is Love and Beauty lip gloss. And it's from Forever 21. Yes, you heard it right. Forever 21. They actually have beauty products now. And this lip gloss, if you guys are looking for an inexpensive lip gloss. Okay, this is this comes with three little lip glosses. And it's like a purpley hot pink more of a peachy hot pink and then a light light pink in the center. This was only $4.80. This lip gloss is really good. It's not too like the sticky, the nasty sticky. It's like you can actually talk and move your lips and it's really pigmented and shimmery. So the kind of this I've been using is this peach one. Well it's not really peach, it's like hot pink but it has more of the more orange than purpley in it and so I've been using that as well just to give my lips a little bit more color so I'm gonna go ahead and apply a little bit of that on my bottom lip just like that Just a little bit like that, and it works really well. I love it, and it smells super good. I'm not sure if they all smell different or the same. I can't really tell, but anyway. So if you're looking for a good lip gloss, that's a good one. It's like my everyday look these days, guys. Not that big of a deal. Um, I don't know. It's fun. I like to do the winged look every once in a while. I don't know. I feel like it makes my eyes look a little bit bigger. Um, but yeah. So that was my look, and if you guys like it and you want more, subscribe. Leave me a comment telling me what you think. Um, yeah. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you next time. Bye.